Welcome back to today's post-apocalyptic world. We'll begin season two by looking at this cup of coffee in a whole new way. Notice how similar to one of our billions of galaxies our morning cup looks like when adding creamer. As the reaction continues and slows, some of the molecules combine to different sizes and revolve around a larger central body at different speeds. Does that remind us of anything? How can it be that such an accurate model of the creation of our solar system be depicted in such an everyday random activity? Well, that's exactly what this series is all about. Left alone, our cup will cool to room temperature, we all know that, so we better drink it fast. But if we look at it from the point of view of thermodynamics, we can begin to unravel the mysteries of the universe. Thermodynamics is a branch of physics that deals with the relationship between heat and other forms of energy, such as mechanical, chemical, and electrical. This is a Stirling engine, invented by a guy of the same name. But that's not the amazing part. It is an external combustion engine that takes advantage of the hotter, faster moving molecules in the coffee to heat up the lower chamber of the Stirling engine, thereby moving a piston and spinning the wheel just like in your car. And if we like assembling Legos in a non-random fashion, we can make fun and interesting machines like this that can actually do work for us, like this elevator. This system will continue to work for us as long as the temperature of the coffee is hot enough to be able to move the piston and move the wheel. When the coffee and room reach equilibrium, there will not be enough force to move the piston and move the wheel and everything will stop. So why should all this be interesting? Well, thermodynamically speaking, this is exactly how the Earth and everything on it is powered and even created. The cup of coffee and the sun being sources of free potential energy will heat, power, and otherwise alter their surroundings in the most efficient and sometimes unpredictable and beautiful ways. Is it mere coincidence that what goes on in our morning cup of coffee is so similar to what we see when we look up at the heavens? I don't think so. And in fact, I think we can learn a lot about ourselves and our place in the universe with an open mind and a new perspective. Join me on the next episode where together we will explore that great mysterious phenomenon that has created everything in the universe, that powers every cell in our body and all the billions and billions of galaxies. That great mysterious phenomenon is entropy and disorder. Next time on Dave's Post-Apocalyptic World.